Let's cross now to Warsaw to speak to our correspondent, Madalena Chaudenek. Uh, Madalena, obviously this is a, a very much a crucial relationship between these two nations and this comes at an absolute, yeah, as the American leader just said, a critical time. Uh, what is expected to come out of this meeting today? Well, first of all, we, um, as the Polish nation, wanted to hear the words of uh, solidarity from the American um, uh, president because Poland relies on the U.S. and the military support of the U.S. more than on any other country. Um, so for us in this very difficult geopolitical situation with the war just um, around the corner, it's very important to be assured once again that um, we have a very strong ally uh, with the um, uh, American uh, forces and this is what uh, it's expected to come out of those meetings. Also, the significant um, uh, um, question is that um, Biden is sort of putting Poland as a, a leader of this regional um, NATO um, alliance as well and of the eastern flank, which is giving just uh, a lot of importance to Polish uh, government and the Polish army. Um, Madalena, obviously the key thing in all this is the degree of military support that the US can give its ally Poland. What is Poland wanting in terms of support and arms and ammunition? Well, as we hear that uh, Russia might be preparing for another attack or another intensification of the uh, military operations in uh, Ukraine. P Poland, of course, wants to hear once again what Joe Biden already said, that the uh, U.S. will protect every single uh, square and uh, centimeter of the soil um, of Poland, and which is not only Polish soil, but also a NATO soil. So I think this is the most important thing for now as well, just to reassure everyone here that we have full support and we are fully baked by the President Biden and the American um, and the US uh, at this very difficult moment. Magdalena Chardonic in Warsaw, who we'll be coming back to later in the afternoon after Joe Biden gives uh, that key speech at the Royal Palace later in the day. Thank you, Magdalena.